So let's go ahead and start off with some tarot, okay? So immediately I see the star. So that's like <laughs> letting me know that we in star power right now, baby. We got a lot of planets, you know, acting crazy. I mean, they could just chill out right now if they really wanted to because it's on and popping and it's going to be on and popping for a while. So like a lot of people may be in the energy of not knowing what's going on. What are they receiving at this time? Feeling like they're in the unknown, right? <laughs> we in the unknown period. We had a period where everything is kind of winding back. You know what I mean? The motion in the ocean is kind of coming together to create the things that we look forward to or the things we don't look forward to, right? Okay, so let's go. Let's tap in respect to the most high mother and father. <sighs> What's the energy for the collective? What's the energy for the collective at this time? Okay. We have the magician. <clears throat> All right. So right now, like I was saying, the en the energies, the planets, the spirit, if you will, is at a is in a chaos. Okay. And chaos doesn't always mean bad. It doesn't always mean good. Chaos is just what it is. There's a chaotic energy going on because there's a lot of balance that has to be that is actually coming into formation, so it can be um, took in, took in. What am I saying? Took in place, so it can be took in place. Okay, so the magician. So this is a time of manifesting. Some of you may be, you know, feeling like really creative. Okay, pulling stuff out the air, baby, and just making stuff happen. All right. So also, whew, mm, this is a time about being resourceful, the art of communication, speaking, the mercury energy, the throat chakra, speaking the things that you want, speaking against the things that you do not want. Everybody is so quick to post, tap, like, share, but I need you to be, spirit needs you to be more communicative, okay? Using that throat, speaking, okay? Magical, creating with your voice, okay? Taking everything that's around you and making it into something that's going to be tasty lasting okay so this is also about willpower this is also about being an alchemist okay the artist the art okay creating your own art not looking at somebody else's paper this is about coming in using all the elements use everything that's around you um to get the best outcome for yourself okay who is this <laughs> we got the six of pentacles okay so that's scorpio energy all right um that's just like yeah that water energy that's like somebody that's the energy of wanting to share okay wanting to spread the word wanting to communicate something to other people all right this is a good word though this is a word um uh, and you look at this card Okay, this is giving to a community. This is giving to people. These are good gifts. These are flowers. This is spiritual knowledge. This is a, a way, a, a, a leadership role, okay? This is innocence. This is an energy of being playful. So we need to find some way to be playful, to tap into our innocence, to our inner child, to give, to receive. Give to the people who are in need and who are not in need. Give to those who have something to offer to others, okay? Because it's like harmonize we want to harmonize with everything around us so we can create the best outcomes okay so this is a carefree attitude this is joy okay so this could be what's coming in for the collective those of you who planted your good seeds and are doing the work or those of you who are inclined to do the work and are trying to start in somewhere yeah this is about being with family this is that cancer energy the sensual the delights of life the empress delights of life right <laughs> So what else do we have for the collective at this time? Hmm. More so, where are we headed? Where are we headed? Where are we headed? Where's the collective headed spirit? Where are we headed? I'm talking about the upswing, the ones who are on the upswing. I'm not talking about y'all downtrodden who, who can't get a grip. Okay, and it's no disrespect because I'm here to lead the way in a sense, but it's like I'm talking to those who are, y'all know what I'm talking about. You ready? What we got for the collective? 
<laughs> that popped out Knight of Pentacles, okay? So, Knight of Pentacles, somebody who's on a journey. This is somebody who has something to offer, who, who you know, he got his horse. They on, he, he on his way, all right? He ain't quite a king yet, okay? But he's a knight, and he's ready. He's standing with honor. He's coming forth. He's coming forth with a coin, okay? So, be expecting to um, receive a coin. Perhaps this is somebody who... You know, you may be dating. Maybe there's a man, a woman. You know, I know it's a, it's a, a masculine energy here, but it goes both ways, okay? So maybe there's somebody who's ready to step to you with a ring, with a coin, with a decision, with an opportunity, or somebody who's ready to communicate something to you, as we can see um, with this, with the magician, okay? Letting us know somebody is here to communicate something, Okay. All right, so maybe whoever's coming to communicate with you is coming to bring a word that's going to be beneficial. Maybe something that's going to be money making or healing or beneficial. Definitely beneficial because the night didn't go on no journey for no reason. Okay, so this is about being consistent, being practical, reliable, being efficient, letting go of those difficult situations so you can go ahead on your journey um, smoothly. Okay, but you always got your sword as a knight if you need to pull it out. But this sword is. This knight is on the chase for some type of some money, some coin, right? There's going to be some improvements, okay? Just be determined and be responsible, okay? So let's go ahead and tap into the healing waters, okay? Let's get a healing message for the collective. What is the healing message for the collective at this time? We got somebody who's the alchemist. We have somebody who has something to offer, Okay, someone who's given a pinnacle, somebody who's really like in their childlike energy. Someone who, when you're in your childlike energy, you're unafraid, right? Because out of the mouths of children come whatever it is <laughs> that the imagination is, is 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 running, right? Okay. Yeah. So what else? What's the healing message for the collective at this time? What's the healing message for the collective at this time? Selfie, come out of hiding, embrace who you really are. Come out of hiding and embrace who you are. That is the message for the collective. Let's see if I can find the complete message. Come on, these cards be a pain in the butt sometimes. They don't have no directory. But anyway, this is about coming out of hiding, okay? Uh, unsubmerge yourself. I think I'm there, y'all. Yeah, we're about to be there. And that's a dolphin, and there's a um, mermaid there. So let's tap in. How are you being called to embrace who you are truly? Are there ways that you're hiding your unique light from the world? How can you embrace even more of who you truly are? Are there ways that you're not showing up as, as your full true self in your life or in your relationships? How are you being called to share your voice? Where do you feel held captive? What do you need to do to feel free? So those are just some of the beautiful questions that we can be asking ourselves at this point. How can I embrace who I truly am? How can you embrace who you truly are? All right. So a good way to find out who you are is, first of all, understanding your birth chart. OK, so if you don't know what a birth chart is, go ahead and look it up. Go ahead and get it. Read it thoroughly. OK, don't try to have any understanding if you're not you know, good with astrology, but just read the information that's in there and see where it resonates at. So with that said, I want to ask you to like, ask you to subscribe, Empress the Light Oracle. I really appreciate everybody who does, you know, like, subscribe, and comment on my day ones. Much love to you. Peace. Ashe.